All right, folks, welcome back to Karak Evelrun's Gaming. We're in a medieval dynasty, and today I have a special video for you. I'm going to show you where you can get one of the best bows right from the start of the game. Now, this particular video is going to have spoilers in it. Now, the spoiler is, is we're going to reveal a key location in the main story of the game. Now, this particular location isn't hidden from you. You can stumble upon this at any point when you're playing. You may not know what it is if you're new to Medieval Dynasty. Um, however, it does play an important role in the story, and it's a little bit cheesy to be able to uh, come here and get this weapon right away, but it is available to you at the start. As you can see, I have just started a new life. I haven't even talked to the Castilian yet. So before I get going, let me say thank you. Thank you for taking your time to watch my content. I really appreciate it. Please smash that like button. Please subscribe. Please share the video. All that stuff really helps the channel out, and I really, really appreciate the support. Thank you. So, Medieval Dynasty has just updated through what they call the Air or Hair Dynasty. Depends on how you pronounce it. Um, uh, hair Update. Okay, so this is a new update to the game. A lot of people are just coming back to Medieval Dynasty or they're just discovering it. So as a quick reminder, when you first play the game, um, you're usually running around collecting resources, picking a place to build your particular dynasty. You're going to need to hunt. You're going to need to defend yourself eventually when you get to robbers. There are multiple types of weapons in this game. You can use knives, you can use axes, but you're going to be using a bow a lot of the time. Now, there's four or five different types of bows. There's also crossbows. Now, crossbows are the most powerful weapon in the game so far. But for bows, the, the most powerful bow in the game, regular bow, is a long bow. So, we're here. Okay, now this location is key to the main storyline. I'm not going to do any additional spoilers on that. If you want to play the main story, you will end up coming here eventually. However, this location is active whenever you start a new game, and you need to come and find it if you so choose, and you can loot it. It is here. This is the location. It's just to the northwest of Hornica, and it is a little northeast to this little, little pond right here, which I'm going to have another separate video on soon. So... This little camp, again, uh, play, is a part of the main story. But you can loot everything in here. And the weapon that you want is right here. This is the longbow. Okay? This is the best bow that you can get in the game. And you can see that it's 100%. It's not damaged. Now, often when you find um, items out in abandoned camps, they'll be worn out or used, you know, 76%, whatever. This one is 100%. You also have some poisoned copper arrows here, but the longbow is what we want. So let's take a look at that longbow real quickly. This longbow, a type of ranged weapon crafted at the workbench in the smithy or the hunting lodge, requires arrows in the quiver, can be used for hunting and combat. 55 damage. That is the strongest regular bow in the game. Um, the iron crossbow however, has 75 damage. But you can go and get this longbow right at the start of the game. Um, and you've got arrows right here. And it's pretty potent. Uh, it's a strong bow. It, it will, you can take, as your hunting skill improves, you're going to be able to take down some big game. Like, there's a moose right there. A moose is considered big game. You're going to need a couple of arrows for that. But let's take a real quick look at your skills. When you look at hunting, um, you've got steady hand, which is bow related. Um, this is, yeah, 10% steady or aiming with ranged weapons. Okay, that's important to get. You've up here. You've got um, slower durability loss for weapons, which is important. You've got strong arm, 10% slower stamina consumption during aiming. And you've got lock and load, 10% faster. So as you can see here, 
of all of the skills pertaining to a bow, there's nothing that increases your damage. So the main damage statistic that you're looking for is on the bow itself. Now, as you travel through Medieval Dynasty, you're going to find other bows. Um, I think the regular bow is 35 damage. It's 55 damage is pretty significant. Again, it's not as strong as a crossbow, but it's pretty, it's the strongest regular bow, I guess, compound bow that you can get. And there's also some arrows here. Now, just as a quick aside, you can loot all of this stuff. You can see how it's green. It's not actually stealing. Um, you've got logs, you've got planks, you've got a bucket. Um, these particular two sacks don't have anything in them. Get a straw hat, some firewood. I mean, you know, it, there's nothing huge here except for that longbow and arrows. That longbow is, is if you're just starting a new playthrough and you're looking for the best weapon you can get easily early on, that's where you want to go. Um, I, I think that stealing is part of a gameplay, a, a playthrough if you so choose. There are consequences to stealing in the game if you get caught. I'm not going to spoil. There is no consequences for um, robbing this little camp blind. Again, this camp location does play a larger role in in the storyline, but if you want a very powerful weapon early on in the game, you come here. I believe you're going to be starting right around here. I think it's here. Okay, so it's really not that far of a run. Okay. But you want to come south it's right in between these two roads right here and you you will have this uh, little lake opened up on your map it's just to the to the northeast of that and it's to the northwest of Hornica um, definitely come here get your longbow 55 damage and get your three poison copper arrows which each one of them is 40 damage pretty pretty powerful weapon to start the game out with Anyways, that's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Um, did you go and get this bow right away to start your playthrough? Let me know in the comments. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll talk to you again soon.